there welcome to the ebook show where we update you on new trending movies be it hollywood nollywood or bollywood and my name is sandra yamedu and i'm here to give you the updates of this new trending movie called love in chaos love in chaos and it's basically centered on clinton and then sonia yeah Clinton and Sonia. So we, we see that situation where we find ourselves somewhere either in hostel, school, work or anywhere at all and then we meet this um, kind of neighbor or something like that that we don't meet. We do not meet. We can't be friends. Do you get it? We can't be friends. So this is um the situation that was between Sonia and then Clinton. Sonia was a new tenant at um, where Clinton was staying, but they seemed not to like each other, even from the first impression, because they didn't have a good start. Um, Sonia was trying to, you know, take a rest in her new apartment, I mean, new room or that, but um, uh, Clinton was uh, a musician, should I say, an artist, so he was always like kind of coming up with you know lyrics verses and all those stuff and he has to try them in his room so due to that he was always kind of making noises and then making the place uncomfortable late at night so sonia was always kind of having um you know um disturbance and then stress when it comes to sleeping trying to get rest at night so because of that sonia didn't just like clinton sometimes he she goes to um clinton to tell him hey like you're kind of you know making noise and that and clinton will, would rather like make the volume higher in order to torment her so sonia didn't just like clinton but sometimes clinton comes around trying to make sonia think like he's good actually he was good but because of the first impression and how they met sonia didn't just like clinton and so she didn't see the good aspects of clinton clinton tried very hard to you know show the good side and everything to sonia to make her know that he isn't a bad person but yet sonia wasn't seeing that and sonia was the type that was an introvert didn't like to open up and all those kind of you know like um in, in inside you know behaviors you know when you're an introvert you hardly even smile to people and all the stuff you're always frowning when you're outside and that that was sonia and then clinton at the other hand was kind of extrovert and then extrovert yeah and because of her the music career that he he was doing and that he was kind of outgoing and then open up like he had friends that could come around for party and all the stuff and then so one day he was like they can't leave as enemies so in order to make up so that they could become friends clinton woke up and then and prepared something nice for sonia but sonia rejected it sonia said she isn't ready to be friends with um clinton because of the first impression so clinton was like you know what i don't even know why i wasted my time in doing all this if you don't want me as friend go away <laughs> go away so like yeah they fought again and then they left but later clinton came again trying to you know convince um sonia that sonia i'm a good person like you can't just see it open up you would notice but sonia was like no i am not ready and then Clinton, so the last time Clinton went there, Clinton promised not to come there again. But yes, till he came. But then this one, he was like, look, I'm not coming back again. And with this, this is final. And I know you would need my help one day. And then Sonia was like, why would I ever even need your help? I am never going to need your help, in quote. So Clinton left. And then unfortunately, uh, days later, um, there was like kind of some intruders in their home should i say um thieves so when they came there and then sonia heard the commotion outside you know there were lots of tenants so they started with uh, other people so sonia happened to hear it and then was like she needed to act fast so she didn't also know uh, any like anybody else to go to than to go to clinton because apparently clinton was the only person she knows 
even though they are not free but she knows him somehow and who cares this time she needs help so she didn't care whether they had this relationship or not so despite their old relationship sonia didn't really care sonia was like i don't care the relationship this one is between life and death do you get it so sonia just went to uh, clinton regardless of their relationship and that and then clinton too was aware of what was going on and then sonia was like I I left my laptop and then Clayton was like look right now laptop is not the most important thing here what is important is your life your health and you know and then Clinton was like okay wait you said you are the only daughter of your mom so just stay here I'll go and then do it and then you know Clinton was going and Sonia was like nah and Clinton was like I see she cares she was like yeah I care well you know back and forth still um clinton went and then fought the thieves and then took the laptop brought it you know it, it wasn't just once they really um i mean suffered i mean clinton really um went through a lot to fight them and all this stuff but in the end or at the end they all you know survived and then the police took the thieves away and then from there their relationship was you know getting okay better you know sonia started um realizing that she was wrong about um clinton because clinton was a good guy when he was risking his life for just the laptop and hair he didn't even think of anything he didn't think of himself he all he was thinking was um how to help them get out from the situation despite whatever um situation may come up upon him so clinton was um was now seen as a good person in front of um sonia so their relationship grew grew well uh, you know they became very close and blah 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 things happened they were now talking and from enemies to besties yes enemies to besties and it was going on well everything was going well until you know sonia um started feeling like uh well maybe th there's more to you know their relationship and then they ended up having you know intimacy like a you see that kind of thing so you know that feeling where you, you know you really have that strong thing passion and then you go into having intimacy but after which you feel like nah i'm not ready for a relationship i'm not ready to go in a relationship with this person i mean i don't i don't know how he is and looking at his public figure um uh, like i don't like people like that you know i'm an introvert i i need peace and all those stuff this kind of people they are exposed to so many girls and that he might not take me for you know anything so let me just end it here let's just act as if nothing has happened let's just maintain the friendship status quo you know and clinton didn't like that clinton didn't want that clinton was like i mean serious about sonia but sonia failed to look at it at that point do you get it Clinton um just made it clear to Sonia that look Sonia um I'm really in love with you I'm not here to joke with you okay it's not like what you're thinking I am really serious about you but Sonia was like still confused I mean you you get what I'm trying to say see that stage where you're confused you don't know whether to give this person the chance or what something like that because you're afraid of um getting a broken hearted so you see broken heart so um Sonia was like hey like let's maintain the friends and then clinton was like okay i get it so then you know they started uh, moving on with their lives again but clinton was finding it hard to you know play like they being just friends after whatever ha had happened between them clinton was finding it difficult to you know see her as a friend so if i can't see you as a friend then let me just ignore you so that i can get rid of you in my mind if you're not ready so as clinton was always ignoring sonia um time passed and sonia felt like nah i think i'm making a mistake because it has been days weeks and i feel like the feeling and everything i can't forget about what happened between um between me and then clinton so then what do i do I just have to reconsider what Clinton was saying. So I don't want the friendship anymore. But then Clinton was, you know, on, on, on the road of forgetting Sonia. So one day, you know, like, just like any other day, they were going, uh, coming out to, you know, do, get something from the fridge or whatever. And then they happened to meet. And then Clinton was like, hey, it's been a, it's been a long time. It's been a while. And then Sonia was like, yeah 
uh, i hope you're doing well and blah 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 and so sonia was trying to bring in um what they talked about their relationship and clinton was like hey i get it don't don't go there i'm trying i'll forget about you okay so then sonia was like no i am not asking you to forget about me i have reconsidered my decision and i'm ready to be with you that was a yay so clinton was like very happy and then was like okay that's good i was just waiting for that and if this is what you're saying then i'm so so glad and i'm ready let's just bring it on so you know they started going out again like the the nice couple and that it's it's a very nice movie you know these things are happening yeah you get to a situation you like this person but due to some one or two things you're just trying to let that relationship go i mean just try you never know where your luck may shine okay so i recommend this movie to you if you want to watch the whole movie just go to the description column the link is there just tap on it it will send you straight to this movie and if you're a first time or this is your first time coming across my video just go to the subscription button and then subscribe to my channel hit on the bell icon to get notification anytime i post a video and my name is sandra yamenu and don't forget to keep liking sharing and commenting your ideas and keep watching the ebook show see you again bye yeah.